we've kind of been doing this more recently as a segment, whether it's on or off the court, what is your wildest overseas story? <laughs> and you can have multiples uh, too. It, yeah, the wildest one is um, my first year in Mexico, seeing uh, a shootout between the cartel and, and the militia, the government, you know, dri driving from home from practice and uh, the uh, seeing some of my teammates run at me, run towards the back of the bus. You know, I'm like, are they joking or what? You know, when the bus comes to a halt and you know, they're yelling to everybody to get down. They're literally shooting at the Walmart across the street from our hotel, you know. So hearing different stories about that, hearing, literally seeing, you know, some of the streets blocked off with buses because the cartel had blocked the, the streets off so they wouldn't be chased. You know, that was, it was stuff like out of a movie, you know. That, that's why the uh, I've always been intrigued by, like, cartel movies and shows and stuff like that. I mean... I grew up, my mom always would watch court TV, so I've always been into the crime shows, basically. I, since high school, I've always been interested in, like, the CSI, crime scene investigation, forensics type stuff. So, yeah, seeing that up hand, up close and personal, you know, I, I wouldn't say I'd want to see again, but it was, that was probably the wildest thing I've seen, you know, let, let alone in when I was with the, uh, the Caballeros of Cuyacan, you know, that's, Cuyacan is where El Chapo is from, you know, and then watching, there, it's a really good El Chapo series on Netflix and seeing that, okay, he was waging war <laughs> with the cartel in Nuevo Laredo, basically where the Toros was from. So it's, it was mind blowing to see, damn, I really played for the two teams, the two cities where El Chapo was really, you know, battling. It was, it was crazy to see, basically. It was mind blowing. So, you know, I'm, Narcos has always been one of my favorite shows to watch for sure. Um, outside of that, though, I'm in France when I had my my parents come out. Uh, this was in January. You know, France is is really well known for strikes and stuff, which can tend to end in some crazy protest riots type stuff. And us being in Nantes in downtown, and we're at the highest building in Nantes. You know, you can see the whole city when you're going out of the city. And, you know, on one of the streets, you literally see a protest happening. And then out of nowhere, you see the firemen on top of the, on one of the buildings, water hosing the whole, all the people in the protest. So that was pretty crazy to see as well. Hello, and thanks for watching. Be sure to give the video a like, and you can watch more videos over here. Uh, you can also click subscribe over here, so you're notified when we have new content here on Expat Hoops.